Hi everybody, welcome back. Welcome back to the channel. Today I received my Auxbeam RGB switch panel. And I thought I'd just open it with you. So let's have a look inside the box. Just, just get straight into it. Okay, so it's quite a nice box really. A bit damaged there, probably from a bit of post. Let's have a look what's in here. Some gump. A load of stickers. I suppose they go on the front there. Let's put them out of the way. Right. That's quite right, isn't it? Ah. So I've got an app for your phone. That's quite cool. We'll get into that later. So there's the stickers. Quite a few stickers on there. That fucking idiot on his stupid motorbike I can hear in the background. Right, so there's the panel. I suppose that would sit on the dash, wouldn't it? It's quite nice. On off button in the middle. And then eight separate switches. Looks quite well made and went metal. And then signal wire plug. Some mounting screws, washers, and our own key. Another wire. And now I imagine that is for the mounting plate for the switch panel. Here. Hmm. Okay. Breaker. And I suppose this is the brain. So, 1,200 1, watts. The amps. Get that out. Uh, fuses, so there's a positive, negative, control panel input, spare fuses, it's quite nice, it's all set in some kind of resin, put that down, so this is what I like about aux beam stuff, properly binded wiring loom, nice plug, I suppose that goes onto the uh, onto there. What else we got? Strip of metal, some cable ties. All right, so they give you everything. So I suppose that would go on your battery. So they have pretty much thought of everything, didn't they? Looks quite a nice bit of kit. This is what I like about the all spin stuff. Really, really, really thought out. Nicely packaged. So I suppose I better read the destructions and have a have a look and see where I can put it. Now obviously I'd like the uh, control panel to go there, where those two lights are, and that'll tidy up the dash. And probably, Probably drill a hole at the, at the front here. Might have to take the ceiling down a little bit and have a um, uh, a multi gland box on the roof. So I've only got one. Well, the cables coming into here. So I might put this up here or up there somewhere. And it all can go in there, and then obviously run a. We well, have to run a power cable. I think it'll have to go underneath the driver's seat because running cables all the way from there for a switch panel all the way behind behind the shower underneath the bed because the electrics are down there it might be a bit of a bit of a mission 
So there you go. Quick unboxing video of the Orcs Bean RGB 8 gang multifunction switch panel. Thanks for watching. Cheers, bye.